students love science and that's primarily because of just their inherent nature. They are so curious about the world around them. I think it's really important to get the research that we do out to not only the scientific community but the broader um, general public and the community because science affects everyone and you know we don't do the research just for our own personal enlightenment we do it for the better of society and so I think the best way to get that out there is to get students and children excited about science. With the focus on STEM education, it's been a big pull to kind of get uh, scientists involved in the classroom and to adjust our focus from just research into actually sharing that knowledge and helping a community and providing teachers with contacts and resources that they already don't have the time or money to really invest in. Wherever I've lived and wherever I've taught, I've tried to really gain partnerships with organizations that are out there to bring information into my classroom. And one of the best ways to get that is to go straight to the source, which is our scientists, our local scientists. We have a huge concentration of scientists here in Carteret County with all of the marine science opportunities that we have, including um, even our, just our commercial fishermen or the port, all of those kinds of things. And so when I saw that this was available, um, I knew I had to be here. We hope teachers walk away from this event holding a variety of materials that they can then take back to their classrooms and implement. We would really like to make it an annual event where we can actually keep bringing teachers in and hopefully broaden our spectrum of scientists as well so that we can bring in new material and teachers can keep coming back and getting more material. And hopefully this will spread and more teachers will find it intriguing and want to come. My hope is that it will continue, that we'll, we'll be known in this area to have this type of um, avenue for teachers to come and learn more about the research that's going on right in our own backyards.